The Ohio Department of Health released new COVID guidelines today as school districts prepare for the upcoming school year. Will Price reports on how this will affect schools around Athens. Ohio's chief medical officer announced the state's recommendations for classrooms with schools slated to start in about a month. Dr. Bruce Vanderhoff said he strongly recommends vaccinations for those who are eligible and masking for those who are unvaccinated. While these are not required, he said that these recommendations are crucial for the safety of the state's schools. While there are no mandates associated with this guidance, we believe that the recommendations we are issuing are essential to the health of Ohio's youth and the success of the coming school year. The announcement comes as COVID cases have been rising around the state, which is believed to be connected to the Delta variant. Vanderhoff said it's important to keep in mind the effects the virus can have on children. Now, while children are less likely than adults to get severely ill from COVID-19, they're not invincible and most certainly can and do have the risk of becoming ill. Athens City Schools Superintendent Tom Gibbs says he's worked with superintendents across Athens County on their guidelines for the upcoming school year. They've held meetings with the Athens City County Health Department on their protocols since the onset of the pandemic last year. Just talking through the, all, the, all the guidance that comes out and then coming up with kind of uh, trying to be as similar as possible in what, what the uh, protocols are that we implement in the districts in Athens County. He says certain things, like providing masks and extra cleaning, would be a part of their plan to combat COVID-19, but their protocols are not yet finalized. Reporting for Newswatch, I'm Will Price in Athens. Vanderhoff said that the full guidelines will be uploaded to the Ohio Department of Health website no later than tomorrow.